Hello and welcome back. After a dalliance with the other kits from the other companies, I finally have a science fair kit. This kit is the 201 Electronic Project Lab and as you can see it's been around the block some time because the box is absolutely shattered. If we open it up you can see I've already started a project in it and as with other ones you get a nice collection of wires in the bottom of the box, nice collection of parts. Let's just pull all these out. Unlike the more modern kits, these wires are all stranded, whereas the other kits had a solid wires. And you can see it's so old. This I did get this back in the 90s. But half the, the wires need resoldering. Also note that I've forgotten batteries, so give me a second while I go and find some batteries. Right, I've got some batteries this time. Let's try putting them in the right way around. Right way around. Uh, there. Right. Here's the manual. And as you can see, it's very battered and the back cover is missing. The back cover is actually on the floor anyway, so. Right, that's through. Back to them. <sighs> lots and lots of project. Explanation of the various parts. How to get started, how to build projects. Troubleshooting suggestions. Keep a notebook. This is good and well and true. A few final thoughts. If all else fails, read the manual. Right. So, project one. Let's start with a really complicated one. You've probably seen a roulette wheel or a wheel of fortune type game in operation. You know how it works. Her players try to guess where the wheel will stop and when they will win if they guess right. We couldn't find room in the kit for the real thing so we've included an electronic version. The project has a lot of wiring connections so wire it slowly and carefully. Be sure to the control knob is set to off on the front uh, during the wiring. Using the electronic wheel of full fortune is super simple. Turn the control knob clockwise to on and press down the key. You'll notice the lower half of the digital display will light up and seem to spin around. It's not really spinning of course. The different segments are just rapidly blinking on and off, one after the other. During the spinning you'll hear a funny sound hearing from the speaker. After a few moments, both the spinning and the sound will slow down. Eventually it will stop with just one segment lit and a steady sound coming from the speaker. You'll notice a couple of interesting things about this circuit. Each segment of the, digi of the display has its own sound. And the speed at which the control display spins depends on the control. Try moving the control knob while the wheel is spinning. Notice how you can make it slow down or speed up. You can use this project as a game by guessing which segment will be lit when the wheel finally stops spinning. Or you can try to make the wheel stop at a certain segment by adjusting the control while it is spinning. The project is a digital circuit. We'll find out more about that later. Notice how this project uses both integrated circuits in your kit. Do you know what? an integrated circuit is probably not but we'll take a guess and make a look at it 
make a note of it. Remember, we suggest that you keep a personal notebook. Now's your chance to use it. Later on, we'll find we'll see how close you come to the right answer. The circuit probably seems very complicated now, but by the end of this manual, you'll be able to explain how it works. Think we're joking? Just will you wait and see? Right, so let's move the manual out of the way and start the wiring. Pick up your box of cables, find somewhere to put them. There we start. Six to nine, so six to nine. Nine. Nine to seventy-three. Nine to seventy-three, which is over here. No, nine to seventy-three, not hundred and seventy-three. Nine to seventy-three. There's a stray wire there. Seventy-three. Nine. Eighty to one hundred and twenty-seven. Eighty to one hundred and twenty-seven over there. Right now, ten goes to eighty-one. to 98 to 1 to 98 98 to 104 throw a wire on the floor so what did we say? Two to one, two, two, one, two, two, one, one, eight, one, one, eight. To fifty eight, fifty eight, to 
51. Then we want 27 to 137. So 137. Hundred and thirty seven is up here. Twenty eight to one oh one. Thirty-one to thirty-three. Right. Thirty-one to thirty-three. Thirty-three to thirty-five. Of wires thirty two to eighty two. Thirty two to eighty two. Eighty two. Then we want thirty four to forty two. Thirty four to forty two. Forty two. Thirty six to forty four.
1977. Fifty-two to ninety-six. And ninety-six to ninety-two. Seventy-three, which is the speaker. Fifty-four to one hundred and seventy-four. To one hundred and forty, one hundred and forty, all the way over here. So one hundred and forty, we all that super, super long wire. Seventy one to one hundred and forty five. One hundred and forty five is over here. And it doesn't fit, so that's not it. I'd move that back there so you can get a better idea. It's one to 145, then 145 to 117. Unfortunately, is a long wire. Then seventy four to seventy nine. to 75, so 75, say, to 97, to 97, to 97, 97 to 75, then 75 
Curse of being old wires. Then now we got 107. Where did we lose 107? 107. It's 113. Then eighty four to one hundred and fifty, one hundred and fifty over there. Six. One one six. To one two four. Then we have one 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 to forty three. Forty three to one hundred and Forty one, then forty one to one hundred and fifty one. to 
120. Four, four, to five. Five to seventy eight, which is buried over here. Seventy eight to one oh five. Five to one oh nine to one one nine. One one nine to one two three. Six to one three four. One three four to one three three. Three three to one three one one three one to one three zero oh. one three zero. Oh. One two nine. One two. One two nine. To one two eight. And one two eight to one six eight.
and that should be everything connected. Really could do with more wires, so uh, right. So what he says, he says you switch that on, press the button, there should have been a sound. Hmm. Why do we have no sound? Strange, but anyway, is it speeding around and slowing down? Where does it stop? Over there. I'll turn the knob on. And you can see it gets slower and slower and slower. There we go. Right. Let's turn this back off and see if we can down we've got that goes into there we've got the power lead not there and that tries there try switching on try switching on there we are Crank it all the way around, press the button in. And there we go. And that's project one, the Wheel of Fortune. On the Science Fair 200 in one kit. This takes a lot longer to assemble than, the, than those other kits. So these videos will be delayed a bit longer. They'll only be once a week if I can remember. Thank you for watching and until next time, goodbye for now.